Surprise! Of course I'm here. Did you really think I was gonna let you be alone on Christmas, my love? I would never. I only wish I could have gotten here yesterday. Ugh. Ugh. It's cold out here. <laughs> Can we finish this conversation inside? <laughs> Thanks, baby. Hi! <laughs> Come here. Oh, it is so, 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 so good to see you, too. Oh, I've missed you so, 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 so much. Oh, it's insane. <sighs> it's so hard to only hear your voice, but standing here, seeing you is amazing. Oh, holding you. Mm, smelling you, feeling you. Oh, sometimes I forget you're real and not just some beautiful voice over the phone <laughs> but you're real <laughs> yes and I'm real and I'm here with you for Christmas just us our Christmas our first Christmas together just us <laughs> no more huddled in corners on the phone with each other while everyone tells us to join the party just us together, creating memories and starting traditions and oh. And speaking of tr starting traditions, I have one from when I was a kid. Every night before bed, which I know it's not time for bed, but roll with me here. We would get one present to open on Christmas Eve. So, I got you something. Here, open it. Surprise! Do you like it? Oh, good. Here, let me put it on you. Turn around. You'd told me your favorite necklace broke, so I got you this. Now you can have a piece of me with you, always. Mm-hmm. You noticed! And those stones are our birthstones next to each other. <laughs> Thank you, thank you. I try. But if you liked that, then you are gonna love what I have planned for us today. Mm hmm. I set up a whole day of dates. First and foremost, you know how I'm always talking about my world famous chocolate chip cookies? Well, I made some of the dough before I left, and it survived the drive, but it will only live if I get it in the fridge soon. <laughs> There we go. That will be safe until we get back. We are going. Drummle, please. Ice skating. Listen, I'm terrible, and it's okay if you are too, but I wanted to do the coupley stuff that couples do on the holidays. And, you know, I'm here with you, and I just want to do it all. And honestly, my only goal is to just not fall. <laughs> I don't have to look like a pro or look like I know what I'm doing. I just don't want to fall. <laughs> I got us an appointment for three o'clock. Yes, I wanted to make sure we could go. I didn't want it to be too busy because, you know, it is Christmas Eve. Um, when we get back, we're making those cookies. And then while the cookies bake and cool... We're going to make hot cocoa bombs, so that way once the cocoa bombs are done, the cookies should also be cool. And then we will have cookies and fresh cookies and hot cocoa just in time for Christmas movie time. And then hopefully, you know, we leave some cookies out for Santa and then ride in bed at a decent hour to wake up together on Christmas morning. Yes, I planned all of this. What? You think just because I live 36 hours away, I wasn't going to look up what's in your area so I can make sure we got some fun stuff to do together? <laughs> well, I sure as hell wasn't just going to show up and expect you to plan all the fun activities last second. 
Although, I do need your help bringing stuff up from my car. I had to stop by the store on my way here to get the melting chocolate and the molds and the hot cocoa mix. And then there's also my stuff. I kind of packed to stay for a few days. I didn't know how long you would want me to stay or how long I could stay. Obviously, it's a surprise. So it's not like I can just ask you, but you can kick me out whenever and I'll drive home. Just preferably give me a warning so I can get some sleep before this 36 hour journey back. But I'm cool with whatever. <laughs> I know you wouldn't kick me out, but you know what I mean. I can't believe I'm here either. And wow, your, your place looks great, baby. Your tree is beautiful. Oh, I wish I could have physically been here to help you, but I'm glad you went with those lights over the other ones, though. No, yeah, it goes together great, baby. You did amazing. Oh, one day we will be picking out our tree together for our place and we'll be buying ornaments for us and picking out a star to go on top and then we'll be picking out what's for dinner and then we'll bicker about how to prepare food because I think I know everything sometimes and I'm often wrong. But <laughs> it's all going to be so magical when that day finally comes. Oh, I'm so excited for those days. <sighs> you know what I also scheduled? Enough time for a cuddle party nap before our ice skating time. Mm -hmm. I figured I'd be tired after that last leg of the drive, so I figured I'd play it safe and give us some time to rest. Oh, you know, when I was planning out the trip, it was to do other things. <laughs> Oh, oh, okay. But you know what I could... Oh. Oh, excuse me. But you know what I could go for right now? I could cuddle you up on this super comfy couch with you in my arms, Christmas movie on the TV, and just sleep for an hour. I just need an hour recharge, and then I will be ready for all of the festivities. Oh! Oh my gosh, you know what we should do? I just thought of this. We should go and get matching PJs after skating so we can make our cocoa and cookies in cozy clothes. What do you think? <sighs> I figured you'd like that idea. Oh, I should have gotten those matching PJs when I was getting the hot cocoa stuff. Oh no. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. We can do it together. But first, come here. Come cuddle. <laughs> oh. You are just, oh, amazing. Ugh. And I see how you fall asleep on this couch all the time. Once this movie comes on, I'm gonna pass out. <sighs> um. Oh, yes, that one. I used to watch that movie all the time as a kid. You did too? Awesome. Oh. I love that I know so much about you, but I still learn more. <sighs> yes, yes, I picked that movie. Put her on. If that hat is magic, I want it back. But it's not yours anymore. You threw it away. Don't talk back to your elders, you, you naughty, naughty little <sighs> And you stay in there, or there'll be no carrots for Christmas. You know what I just couldn't stop thinking about and get out of my head on the whole drive here? Well, you know, at least more than normal. The invisible string theory. You know, the universe covertly tying two people together who are just a perfect matchup. <laughs> yes, I know. I think about this and I talk about it all the time. It's like my Roman Empire. <laughs> and you know, when I'm on the road with endless times to think, I kind of ended up writing a poem. Kind of, I guess. <laughs> Honestly, I'm not sure if it's a poem or an essay or if I even remember it all, but I wanted to share it with you. It doesn't have a name because I'm not a poet, but... This is what I got. And you're not allowed to laugh, okay? Okay. In a world unseen, 
a theory weaves, an invisible string that connects all we see. It's a notion that binds us both near and far, linking hearts and souls, a celestial star. Through the tapestry of time and space, this string of connection leaves no trace. It stretches across oceans and through the sky, uniting us all, you and I. It whispers secrets of love and care, giving us a journey beyond compare. With every smile, every tear we shed, the invisible string holds us, never to be led astray. It tugs at our hearts in moments of need, reminding us that we're never alone indeed. In times of joy, it dances and twirls, creating a symphony of connected pearls. No matter the distance, no matter the strife, the invisible string brings comfort to life. It binds us together in a web so grand, a testament to the power of love, hand in hand. <laughs> so let us embrace this theory divine and cherish the invisible string that intertwines. For in its embrace, we find solace and grace, a reminder that we are connected in this vast space. <laughs> and scene. <laughs> Did you like it? <laughs> thank you, thank you. Yeah, you did come up with it. it took almost 36 hours, but... <laughs> I don't know, it just, it makes me think of you. You know, I think about the poem, and as I say the poem out loud, all I can see is your smiling face. I think my invisible string always leads back to you. <laughs> I love you. I love you so much. I'm so happy to just be here with you. <laughs> Merry Christmas, my love.